I am going to fill in the Google AdSense tax information. At first, I wasn't planning to do it, but I guess I have to. YouTube did get back to me. If you haven't seen my other video, I'll put a link on the card so you can check it out. I left you with a pinned comment on the actual video. I replied from YouTube so you would kind of know what would happen if I don't submit my tax information. So I will be filling in the Google AdSense in a UK individual perspective, but I'm guessing it will pretty much be the same if you're not in the US. So let's start. So you go to Add Tax Info, select Individual, select No for Resident of US, then select W8BEN for this bit because it's for non-US individuals. Then start the form. Enter your name and country. The foreign TIN is basically your UK national insurance number. Now you need to enter your home address and click next. Select yes for tax treaty for this is the reason why you are here. And for the special rate and condition I selected services. There is only one thing for you to select in the article and paragraph. So with holding rate you have two selection, either 0 or 30%. I would of course choose 0%. But once you've done that you click next. Then you can see these forms of PDFs for you to check your info. If everything seems good, tick the confirm box and click next. Then you're almost done. Enter your full name, tick yes if you're doing this for yourself, and then click next. Activity and services performed in the US, most likely it's a no, but only you would know which one to tick, so you decide. For the status part, only you would know about this. But for me, I selected the second one, for I do receive payments from Google. If there's something you're not sure of, you can always click on this symbol if you need more information. Now you tick the box, and it's time to submit. And that's it, you're pretty much done. Before, I only selected the services to knock down the percentage. If you really want to knock down the other features, you can, just by submitting a new form, but you'll be back to square one, doing everything again. Once you start submitting a new form, everything is pretty much the same. All you gotta do is just select the other features and knock down the percentage, and then click next. You should have something like this on the tax treaty. And all you got left to do is tick the confirm box for the document part and click next. And for the rest, you should know how to do it. And that's it. Everything should be good. Just to clarify, I am not a professional. If you do need help, I suggest you seek someone that's official to help you out. I hope I done everything correctly and you can leave me a comment if I did make a mistake. And that's it. Hope this video was helpful. I'll see you guys next time.